What's up fam? Today's workout is going to be a 15 minute total body Pilates hourglass x frame shaping. So we're going to be working into a little waist, rounding off the hips and also into some strong sexy shoulders. It's just 15 minutes long and all you need if you've got it is a resistance band. So here I have the Lean with Lily hip band. I'm not going to talk anymore, we're going to get down on the mat and let's bend. Okay, so we're starting off by sitting on the butt bones, making sure that you're nice and high if you need to spread the butt cheeks. From there, we have a slight bend in the knees, the arms are out in front of us, and relax those shoulders. We're gonna roll back to what I call our biting point, to the point where you can really, really feel your core kicking in. Relax the shoulders, breathe, and we're gonna start off with some arm opening. So you're rotating to the left and center. Breath out to the right and center. Really hitting into those obliques, the muscles on the side of the body. Our magic number is 16 today, so we're gonna be doing 16 reps of pretty much everything, and it's a straight 15 minute countdown. Four left, if you can come a little bit lower. Three, come on, let's really work that core. Two, and one. Keep those arms in, hover if you can. You're now gonna hover the right leg, flex the right foot to hit that posterior chain, the muscles down the back of the leg, and we're gonna pump up. Relax those shoulders, three, four, breath out, five, six, And straight change onto the other side, flex that foot, let's go. 15, 14. Good work, plant the foot back down. We're now gonna do some mini crunches, okay? Again, tiny little movements. Really pulling the core in nice and tight. That's five, breathe, six. Now hold, hold there, and we're gonna rush and twist, taking the hands from hip joint to hip joint. Good work, arms out in front of you, slow and controlled. Woo, roll all the way down. Your core should already be on fire, okay? So you're gonna plant the feet down. Good work, guys. I want you to imprint the spine now, flattening the back into the mat. Pull that core in really, really nice and tight. And we're gonna come up into double leg tabletop. So both legs up at 90 degrees. Peel your way up into a crunch. Keep that eye gaze forward in between the thighs and support the head. We're starting off with a scissor, so tapping the toe down into a single leg stretch, straightening out to 45 degrees. Tap down and straighten. And don't forget, keep that breathing nice and calm. Deep breaths in through the nose, out through the mouth. That's four. One more. Now hold it there. Hold, hold, hold. Hold, three, two, and change sides one. Straight onto the other side, eight of these, let's go. Hold it straight, hold, three, two, 
and knees into chest one. Wow, I hope you're feeling the burn too. We're now gonna go with a set of hundreds, but I want you to take your band and pop your band just above your knees. Okay, so we're gonna resist the tension of the band into abduction, so we're pushing out. Double leg tabletop, push out against that band, 90 degrees, up in hover, and pump the arms up and down. I want you to keep that eye gaze forward, breathe in for five, breathe out for five. Breath in, two, three, four, five, breath out. Support the head if you need to. Breath in, two, come on guys, you can do it. We're halfway. Last 40, two, three, four, five, and out, two, three, four, five, last 30. If you can, straighten the legs out, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1. Oh, wow, 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 wow. Your core should be on fire. We're now going to come onto our side work series which is working the outer butt. So here we're really working into sculpting into the hourglass hips, okay? So we're gonna start off by lying all the way down, trying to create a nice gap underneath the side, lifting that waist and pulling the core in tight. Flex that upper foot. We're just gonna start off by lifting and lowering, okay? Keeping the core nice and tight, keeping that gap there, 16, that's four. Good work. From here, we're gonna pretend that the um, leg, can't put my words up there, is literally on a table and you're trying to swipe it forward and back with as minimal jerking as possible, okay? So nice, straight movements, forward and back. Now hold it back in extension and pump it up, 16. 15. Good, now swipe it all the way forward and we're going to repeat, but this time turn the toe down and heel up. 16, 15. Now hold it, hold four, a little bit further forward, three, two, and one. Good work, guys. Straight on up onto all fours. Just to finish off that burn, we're gonna go with 16 fire hydrants. So lifting up to the side and lowering. Three, four, Hold it up, hold it up, four, three, higher, two, and one. Good work, guys, straight onto the other side. We've got to even you out, so coming all the way down, trying to create that nice gap underneath the waist, really pulling that core in tight. Flex the upper foot, let's go. Three, four, Hold it, and we're gonna come back, and forward. Good work. Back, and forward. Really turning on those glutes, the outer thigh muscles as well. Good, now taking it back into extension, we're gonna pump up there, 16, 15. Good work, now bring it forward, toe down, heel up, let's go. 16, 15, 14, come on, all the way. Hold it, 
hold it, hold it, two, and one. Oh wow, that burn. Okay, straight on up onto all fours, into those fire hydrants, no break, let's go, 16. Hold it up, hold it there, three, higher, two, and one. Oh my gosh, my booty is on fire. You're just gonna sway it side to side slightly here. We're into the last section now, guys, which is mainly for our upper body, shaping into the shoulders, an area that us girls tend to neglect, okay? So we need to take the band off. We're gonna do a little bit of chest work, shoulder work, back work. So we are starting off by lying on our stomach. So to get you down onto your stomach, I want you to control the movement. So you're going to spread the fingertips. You're going to work the triceps by tucking the elbows in and slowly lower down. Good work. Okay. From here, I want the forehead resting on the mat or the chin resting on the mat. And you're going to bring the arms down by the side of the body. Squeeze the shoulder blades together. Lift the arms up, lift the head up, and keep looking down in front of you. Squeeze the booty, and we're gonna pump the arms up and down. Reverse hundreds. Keep breathing, guys. We're halfway, really squeeze those shoulder blades together. Keep looking down and come even higher if you can for the last 30 pumps. Ten, nine, higher, seven, six, higher. And one, amazing work. Oh wow, relax those shoulders off. We're now gonna take the arms out in front of us, okay? From here, what I'm gonna get you to do, again, is squeeze those butt muscles, lift the upper body and lift the arms. You're now gonna squeeze the shoulder blades together, straighten the arms out behind, come back and forward. Squeeze, hold, straighten, then back, and dive the arms forward. Squeeze, hold. That's four, we're going to 16. Halfway eight, come even higher if you can. Keep looking down, squeeze that booty, Pull the core in. Good work, just seven left. You should be feeling that burn, guys, okay? Just a little shake off, which is quite hard in this position. We're now gonna go for a bit of swimming, okay? So I want you to turn on the butt muscles and lift the legs up. You're then gonna work into the upper back by lifting the arms up. We're gonna lift up opposite arm to leg. One, two, three. Thirteen, fourteen, two more. Hold up. Four, three, two, and lower down one. Wow, 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 wow. Again, we're going to use that back, pushing up onto the knees, and drop back into a worship pose stretch. Guys, we are going to finish up with a thirty-second boat hold. Okay. So all I want you to do is come on up onto your butt bones like how we started 
grab a hold of the band, bring it out in front of you around your wrists. Roll back to your biting point, face the palms inwards, and if you can, lift the legs up. Push out against that band. Push out and hold. Work that core, come on. 10 seconds left, that's all. If anyone can, straighten the legs out. I want you to hold for another three seconds. Two, one. Woo, guys, wow. Who would have thought Pilates in 15 minutes could burn like that. If you enjoyed this video, please do smash the thumbs up button and way more importantly, hit the subscribe button and the bell icon next to it because I don't want you missing out on what I've got coming up next. And if you don't hit those buttons, you are highly likely to miss it. Don't forget that was day 13 of your 40 day summer shred challenge. So if you haven't started the challenge, make sure you visit my website. The link is down below in the description. It's totally free and you can get stuck in with that 40 day challenge. Otherwise, this workout on its own is absolutely fine. Bye again. <laughs>